What's going on, Giants fans? I'm indifferent. I'm indifferent because I have a lot going on today. Just to let you know, Happy New Year's Eve, everyone. This is the final day of 2023. Uh, whether 2023 for a year for you was bad year, good year, a CIC type of year, uh, hopefully 2024 uh, is better for you. Um, the New York Giants, hopefully the year 2024 is better for the New York Giants as well. It was a tough game, hard fought game. Giants surprisingly kept kept being in this game. They did not give up. Uh, if only we had a good field goal kicker, Mason Crosby, we're straight off the couch, given number 21. You know you are literally coming off straight off a couch and joining a team uh, when your number is 21 for a kicker. Um, that is number usually used for running backs, corners, not a kicker. Tiki Barber's old number is now Mason Crosby's number, who missed two kicks in this game. One was blocked, and then he just missed the game-winning attempt a couple seconds ago. Um, I'm kind of happy we lost. Uh, as long as we beat Philly next week and ruin their playoff seating, uh, that's all I really care about. This was a kind of just a crapshoot game. Uh, Rams needed it more uh, with a win. The Rams are still alive in playoff contention. The Giants were eliminated last week. So this game really didn't matter. However, I still bleed blue. Still a loyal fan. I will watch every single game. Uh, kind of flipping back between this and the Eagles-Cardinals game, which thank you, Arizona Cardinals, for the win. The Eagles now have no shot at first round bye. The Niners can win out, and they will win first round bye. The Cowboys and the Eagles will battle it out. Next week, they don't play each other. We play Philly. I forget who Dallas plays. Maybe the Commanders. But the NFC East is still up for grabs. The Eagles do not look good. And when the Giants suck, at least the Eagles aren't looking too good. Yes, they're still in the playoffs. Yes, they still have a very good record at 11-5. But their chances at a Super Bowl repeat or just getting back there is looking slim. So I'm happy with that. My fantasy team is looking good so far. I'm up 16 points in the championship game. I have Jordan Addison playing. My opponent has Aaron Jones. Anything can happen. We'll see. But wish me luck, guys. But back to the game. Giants didn't really play uh, for anything, but they played hard. They didn't quit. Defense had a couple nice turnovers. Picked off Stafford, I believe, twice. Um, Tyrod Taylor had some nice deep balls to Slayton and Hyatt. Uh, offense looked good. O-line played pretty good for the most part. Um, John Michael Schmitz hung in there blocking Aaron Donald. He had a one really bad holding call. Uh, but other than that, he played pretty decent. Tyree Phillips got hurt like numerous times in the game. Uh, but the Giants lost. 26-25 was the final. They had a chance to win at the end. A nice kickoff or a nice punt return by Gunnar Ozlewski, whatever his last name is. I don't fucking know. Um, nice punt return for a touchdown by him to keep the Giants alive. 26-25. Giants got the ball back. Tyrod Taylor marches them downfield in field goal range, and Mason Crosby, number 21, uh, failed to make the kick. The Giants lose. Uh, they have a really good shot at even the fourth overall pick, and they lose next week, and the Bears keep winning. Um, but huge day in sports. Eagles lose. Uh, the Giants still have a good draft pick. I might win my fantasy championship and his New Year's Eve. Happy New Year's Eve, everybody. We got one more game next uh, next week against the Eagles. Hopefully we can spoil their playoff uh, run. And let's go, G-Men. I'll talk to you guys later. Happy New Year's, everybody.